Shalom and welcome to another episode of our series that we are looking at from 1st Peter chapter 1. We've been looking at encouraging truths that Peter gave to the believers. He encouraged the believers who were going through persecution to have hope even through their season of persecution. Today we see in 1st Peter 1 verse 5 and god in his mighty power will protect you until you receive the salvation because you are trusting him it will be revealed on the last day for all to see peter through these verses gives us a very powerful truth that we can hold on to during our our trials verse 5 shows us how you and i are guarded by the power of god it says the word used there is kept it in some translations it suggested to mean to watch over or to protect or to constantly guard this word protects use is used as a military metaphor and the thought is of a garrison that is guarded by soldiers So what is it that guards us as we go through life and its problems or its disappointments it is the power of god the greek word that is used here is the word dynamis meaning the strength and the ability of god so we do not live our christian life on our own power or our, or on our own ability or our own strength but we draw from the strength and the power of god it is god who makes us able to accomplish anything of value it is god who gives us the strength to overcome every disappointment in life we know that there is tremendous power that is available to every believer and this is made available for us it is operative for us and this power is absolutely sufficient and he guarantees to make it available in your life till the end of this earthly pilgrimage so we are kept in the dynamis power of god and how it is through our faith first of all in order for any of god's promises to manifest in our lives we have to believe that the promises are for us and that god indeed wants us to have them so we need to take it by faith we need to access this using our faith and draw it into ourselves we have to draw on god's word and stand firm knowing that whatever he has promised for us is true so one of the ways to activate this faith in god's promises is when we confess the word so when we are going through those afflict afflictive times when we are going through maybe a global crisis when we feel helpless when we feel uncertain we know we are not hopeless or helpless because we have god's power to keep us and we appropriate this power as we live our lives in faith for to his word let's pray together heavenly father thank you because we are kept in the power of god in the strength and ability of god that no matter what we face in our world today you have given us the power and ability to draw from you so that we can overcome in our life's journey thank you Remind us of your word that we are overcomers and we have victory in you because you are our all-powerful God. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.